the, the climate crazies, they're at it again. Well, they're always at it. But uh, here they are this time at the PGA Travelers Championship. Take a look. Geez, they, they just always know how to endear themselves to people, don't they, Stephen? Oh, absolutely. I mean, th these are people who have no ability to argue for their case. Uh, they have no ability to be able to create anything. And so they're basically all about destruction and disruption. And these are people who are just traumatised by a, a climate cult, apocalyptic movement that has given them every reason to destroy everything um, you know, that, that people enjoy and really no ability to be able to suggest anything constructive in its place. Very quickly before we go, Daniel, you've got the SDA and a few other unions are, are leading a push to give workers a minimum five weeks of annual leave as opposed to the four they've got at the moment. What do you think? Well, I'm in favour of flexibility, and if you want to negotiate that as an employee with your with your boss, go for it. That's great. But if this is mandated, we all know who's going to pay the price. It won't be hmm. the big corporates or the public sector. It'll just be another cost to the, the struggling small and medium enterprises right across the country. Well, I've argued before that um, we should abolish most public holidays and give them, pe give them to people as extra annual leave, and they can then decide when to use them. I mean, having worked uh, in newspapers and journalism for most of my working career, that's how it works. We get uh, six weeks of annual leave, but we work public holidays, and I can take to choose it when I want. Daniel Wilde, Stephen Chavura, thank you for your time.